How's it going everybody? It's Billy here from the Terrible Five and welcome back to the Terrible Five 2. Today we have a really really awesome tutorial about how to make custom text inside of After Effects using the powerful plugin called Element 3D. So as you probably already know, Element 3D came out um, not too long ago, but it's a product by videocopilot.net who also made Action Essentials and Pro Scores and um, they make lots of really great tutorials so go check out videocopilot.net for some other awesome tutorials um, especially using Element 3D so today we're going to be showing you guys how to create custom text using Element 3D in After Effects so let's just jump right to it we're going to pretty much create um, a really really cool text um, slash title from scratch and you can probably see some of our really cool text and stuff like that in trailers and in the most recent Left 4 Dead episodes. That's pretty much what we're going to be creating right now. So to start off, we're going to go up to um, After Effects and create a new composition. So a new composition, um, pretty much, you know, make this whatever you want. 1920 by 1080, frame rate, two seconds long, hit OK. Now we have a new composition, and what we're going to do is go to Layer, New, Solid. And that'll just create a new solid, um, make it black. It doesn't really matter what color it is. Now with our text tool, we're just gonna type in something here, 3D. So there we go, we have our text and you can always go in um, and change the text and change the font, make it whatever you want. So now that we have our text in here, we're gonna select the solid, go to, um, go to Effect, Video Copilot, and Element. Now it'll apply Element 3D to your solid, and basically all you have to do is go into Custom Layers, Custom Text and Masks, go to Path Layer 1 and make it 3D, so make it the text, and then it's as simple as clicking Scene Setup. Now that Element 3D is open, hit Extrude. And if you followed all those directions perfectly, then yeah, you have your text inside of Element 3D floating around looking all cool. What we can do is go over to our presets and just kind of toss something on it and see how it looks. And as you can see, just simply by clicking and dragging something onto our text, we can create a really, really nice look. We can make it gold. We can pretty much do whatever we want with it. Another really cool thing that we can do with Element 3D is you can go to your environment and you can change your environment to be whatever you want it. So you can go to environment, default you can change that to like studio and hit OK and by hitting control and holding it down you can kind of orbit around your environment and place your text kind of wherever you want it to be and wherever you want it to reflect light from the most so you can put it like right there and it will reflect light kind of from back in that area so we can throw a chrome on there and as you can see it'll uh, it'll reflect some of the stuff in the background. So now another thing that we're gonna do is check out the bevels. Now we can throw on like a three layer bevel and get a really, really cool look just simply by dragging and dropping something on to the 3D object that we created using the text. You can throw other bevels onto it. And then the best thing about the bevels is they're not always gonna be the same color. So you can go back to your materials and you can throw something on um, on there and change the color of that, maybe change the color of this, and then maybe toss some gold onto it. And now we have a really, really awesome looking text. Now all this is pretty much like a stylistic choice. Basically, it's just kind of what you think looks good and what you want uh, your text to look like for whatever film or video you're doing. Another thing I'm gonna show you guys right before we jump back into After Effects is the Pro Shaders pack that is, uh, that's part of Element 3D and part of their whole entire group of products. So with Pro Shaders, there's I think something about 100, maybe maybe 200 different textures you can put onto your 3D object and it'll kind of stick with it and make it look really nice. Where you can just throw on, I don't know, any kind of metal you want. And as you can see, just by doing that, it looks totally, totally awesome. Now that we pretty much have our text the way we want it, all we have to do is hit OK and it'll appear back in After Effects. Now the text is still gonna be here, but whatever you do, do not delete 
the text. You want to keep it there. Just hit the I right there and it'll disappear. You can go to group one, you can go to particle look and go to size and scale up your size. Go to layer, new camera and just hit okay. Make it whatever camera you want. And then now you can zoom around this thing. So finally, before we wrap up the tutorial, I wanna show you one more really cool thing you can do inside of Element 3D, which is use the lighting with After Effects to create some really cool lighting effects with your 3D element. So go to Layer, New, Light, and make it whatever color you want, intensity, all that stuff. Do whatever you want with it and create a new light. So we can kind of move this around and get some really, really cool, cool looking lighting effects. So now we have a really, really nice looking lighting effect and it's all done inside of After Effects using Element 3D. And that's basically how you create text inside of After Effects with Element 3D. So that is it for this tutorial. Sorry it took a little bit long, but I just wanted to explain as much as I could and get as much information in there to help you guys out with making text in Element 3D. Don't forget to subscribe and check out our other tutorials. And also don't forget to check out Left 4 Dead Episode 5 and check out the trailer for that on our main channel, The Terrible Five. So that's it for today, guys. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time here on The Terrible Five 2.